Hi everyone, Amy here from Amy's Planner and welcome back to my channel. Um, I have a mini haul video to share with you today. Um, so I went to Picture to Page the other day, it was in Pakenham, which is reasonably close to where I live. I live in Gippsland, so like it's not close close, but it's the closest planner stuff that we sort of ever get. And I wanted to share with you the stuff that I got. So I got some washi from Hobby Hoppers. And then I got some stickers from, actually let's do the stickers first. So, I got some stickers from Live, Loft and Craft. Live, Love and Craft, not Live, Loft. So Live, Love and Craft. And from, um, Luscious Label. So let's do, let's do the Luscious Label one first. So it was amazing seeing everyone. Like I am over the moon with how awesome it was to see everyone and to have like to actually have some planner stuff face to face for the first time in ages so it was pretty cool so i got so i got these eyelash stickers so um i don't like wearing mascara i find that when i wear mascara i tend to rub my eyes so it smears and i get like panda eyes and everything which is not flash as you can imagine um so I get a lash lift and tint. So I get a lash tint every four weeks and a lash lift every eight weeks. And I've got these to mark it because they're not too much. So I found that when I was looking for lash stickers, they all had mascara ones or they were massive. Um, and then my, my, sorry guys, my eyelashes aren't massive. Um, they're just quite dark and got a nice curl to them. So I've got those to mark my appointments. Um, so that was there. And then I grabbed some stuff out of the, um, the oops pile. So I grabbed these stickers, which I think the oops is that they're, the numbers are, some of them are, are a bit off center. Actually, I think all of them are a bit off center. So you got some numbers, um, some date covers. This is from painted Protea, Protea, sorry. And then some starbursty things. Um, so yeah, they're in the oops pile because they're slightly off center, but that doesn't really bother me. So I'm not worried. Um, I also grabbed these from Summer Days. Now the oops in here is they are also a little bit off center for the numbers, but that's fine. Um, there's a little cut through Monday. It's just like a little scrape mark. You know, sometimes you scrape your stickers and there's a black bit at the top, but really no issues with that at all. And they're gorgeous. Love those. Um, I also grabbed this um, set of clear cursive um, uh, day, important days, important days, um, public holidays and stuff. I don't know why these were in the oops pile. I can't really tell. They are stunning. That's fine. Um, so there's those. And then I also grabbed just a whole lot of um, date dots from for Hobonichi. They're in the oops pile because they're unevenly cut, but that's okay. Like, it doesn't hugely bother me. Most of them are okay. I just need some extra date dots. Um, and it's nice to have a couple of extras. So even if some of them are, like, sort of towards the end are a little bit unevenly cut, that's fine. The ones at the side are fine. Not an issue. Um, and then I grabbed a kit and some other bits and pieces from Live, Love, Live, Love and Craft. So quickly I got this sheet of all sorts of stuff so this is like a not a morning person sort of one so day off and the first coffee me time sleep all day dance all night so like a lazy day sort of one which is really cool and then I also grabbed this um little icon one um with like plan and phone and like a laptop and some bits and pieces so that's really cool as well so I grabbed that they're like big samplers I suppose so they're cool, and then I also have this kit. Now, I haven't seen all of it. I've only seen this page and this page, and I knew, saw those and knew I had to have them. So that's pretty good to so just look at it and go, I need this because of the washi. Um, and so my plan is to use this in my memory planner um, for this week, like for the week of... Um, the come on Amy split it out for the week of the um uh 
from Picture to Page show. There we go. Oh my gosh. Um, so I'm just going to hold it up so you can see it. There's some like sidebar boxes, some full boxes. So like blues and creams and like this is purpley brownie color, like home sort of thing. This is really cool. I can easily get two weeks out of this kit. Like it's just so cool. And then you got some like double boxes um, and some label boxes, some mail, money, shopping, phone. Um, some full boxes that have like the bit where you can write in them. Um, date covers, half boxes, bill due. And then some more date covers. Like I said, you can easily get two weeks out of these kits. Um, some washi strips, some deco, weekend. Um, habit trackers, some flags, some more functional boxes. And then... Um, Another full box, some uh, word headers, strips, some more functional boxes, water tracker, some blank functional boxes, a whole lot of quarter boxes, and then some washi. So you only get one lot of washi, but you get along like a handful of pages, this really skinny washi. So like you could make your own or like match some washi from like another collection or another kit. So I just think that's really cool. Like that washi is very sweet. So that's my little sticker haul and then I got washi and I know I don't need any more washi like I just I needed I saw them I'm like oh that's so pretty and then I'm like you know what buy the washi Amy you'll enjoy it you'll feel good about it and yeah so I'm just grabbing out um, some paper so I can swatch them so this is my A5 bit of everything's planner and what to say? yeah I got I got washi from Hobby Hoppers so very cool uh, excited excited for washi I haven't bought washi in ages mainly because I have heaps already um so I got lots of blues and greens. I got a couple of pinks, so I'm like with some foiling, but lots of blues and greens and lots of sort of vintagey stuff because I feel like that's where I'm heading for a little while. Some more like like vintage colours. Anyway, um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly open all of these and get them ready to swatch. Okay, thank goodness I did that off camera. I mean, I have no coordination. We know this. I, I broke my ankle walking down a corridor. Um, I fall over random things all the time. Can't open plastic to save my life. But I'm pretty glad you didn't see me going, trying to get plastic off my fingers. So, because that was not classy. So here's the washi I got. It's kind of a mix of, um, I'm just going to sort it out. Um, that needs to go here. So a mix of, ooh, okay. It's a mix of like space foil stuff and then like vintage stuff and then this is one in the middle because I thought it was really sweet um and you know I always need more florals so I'm going to stand them up so they don't roll away and I'm just going to swatch them in here um my lack of coordination is not helping so I'm going to grab out my ruler and my tweezers to help me work this out so pretty nails are pretty but not great for peeling washi. I'm just very gently going to use my tweezers to get the end up. And, oh, that's so pretty. Um, so, which way does it go? I'm going to put it this way because this is easier for me to roll it out that way. And I'm just going to put in that amount. Gosh, that's pretty. All right, and then the next one from that sort of set. So this is very spacey. This one's like magical. Very gently, just gonna flick this up. There we go. Oh, <gasps> no! Oh, hang on, hang on. Can save it, can save it. Just have to peel it very slowly. It's okay. 
we're saving it. It's fine. So this one does need to go this way because like it's all the same way. So um, I don't have enough space to do it that much. So. So they're a very similar color. I wouldn't say they're exactly the same. Um, this one's a bit more blue. This one's a bit more green. But they're very similar. The foil's the same color. And they've got they've got similar vibes, like space and magic, not always the same, but very similar colors. You wouldn't use them in the same spread, I don't think, but you you know you'd be able to use them in spreads of similar colors, if that makes sense. I feel like I need a magic kit now, or a space kit, or both. So here's the next one. This one's like, um, I saw this and I thought oh, Sailor Moon, but it's not quite Sailor Moon. Let's see if I can line it up without having to tear that edge. Probably not. Don't have the coordination for that. Let's try that again. One more time. Okay, close enough. Um, so it's like a, a purple to pink ombre, ombre with um, uh, stars and moons. And you could very easily use it this way as well as using it this way. So I love that in a washi. Um, vertical rather than horizontal. And then the next one is like a bigger version of that. Like a, not bigger, but like it's it's. It's definitely a matching, like I would say it definitely matches, even though the colours are slightly different. Oh, see, look at that. Sometimes I am very coordinated. These times are few and far between, allow me to assure you that. Okay, maybe they're not very similar. They are, they're clearly not a set, but they are very cool. I will have to trim that edge up, but I'll do it off camera. The next one is this... Um, blue and green and like mustardy yellow it's sort of like palm fronds or flowers or leaves or it's just it's got a nice floral theme to it go really nice with my florals um yeah it's just it's just pretty it's just a pretty little decorative washi which will go really nice in a whole lot of spreads anytime you're using blue or green you could just chuck it in there very happy with that one i will trim up those edges guys it's fine um now onto my more vintagey looking ones this one is um like a blue grid like blue with a white grid it's not i don't know is it navy it's pretty close to being navy but it's not navy Okay, outside of the, like, if I take it away from the light, it's definitely navy. When I bring it into the light, it's just a bit, I don't know. You tell me if you think this is navy or not. It is very cool, though. I do like the grid. Um, I'll get my craft knife out and trim those later. Because now it's beginning to bother me. Oh, my gosh. Now, here's a matching grid, and this one's in, like, a, a grey like a blue gray I don't know it's not quite steel gray it's more blue than that but anyway um and I'll do that one last here is a green like check um or a green is it check is that what you call the material checkered like like um like a uh, picnic rug check in a washi and it's green it reminds me very much of the planners anonymous forest falls washi that one's a red and gold um but i actually like this one better i really do I actually really like that that's so cool oh i'm excited about that one let me just turn it up Oh, I actually, that's stunning. I, I love that. And then this is a daisy on a dark background. Where is the edge? There it is. Oh, 
Can't get the edge off. This one's very sticky. I'm having trouble getting the edge up, but I think once I get the edge up, it should be okay. Maybe. It's a bit short, but that's okay. I'll live with it. All right, so that's oh, that's so cool. I actually love that. So these like are very vintage, and then I grabbed some stamps because I've never had this before. Like this sort of washi. I wonder if I can get this up without damaging it. That's the real question. Um, so oh, hang on. Okay, so these are like stamps, like when you peel them up, oh, whoops, that didn't work. Okay, gonna have to practice my stamp tearing skills, but like they're, actually I will need to like trim these because I'm now like afraid that I'm going to tear them again. But like they're stamps. See if I can get them straight now. Aren't they cool? Like, oh, that's going to be so awesome. Very cool. Very vintage. Very awesome. I love them a lot. Oh, they're so cool. Aren't they cool? Okay, I think they're really cool. You're really looking at me like, oh, Amy, crazy again. Having a crazy moment, I see. But that's okay. I think they're like gorgeous. And there's one more. So there's probably one more design that I just haven't grabbed out. But I, yeah, there is one more. There's like a, a purple, like pansies. Probably actually there's two more designs. But I'm not going to grab them all now because I've run out of space. But there is my uh, washi haul from Peach to Page. Um... Oh, they're so cool. Like, oh. If I had to say which one is my favourite, it would be either of these two. And I like this. I think it actually goes really well with that. I like it a lot. Of all of them, this one's the least matchy. Like, it doesn't go with anything. That being said, I do like it a lot. So, that's cool. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to bring everything back together. So, I can just give you a quick flick. So I had the stickers. Sorry, sorry, I have the washi. Oh, isn't it gorgeous? Have the washi. Have lots of stickers from Luscious Labels. Have lots of stickers from Live, Love, Love, ugh, Live, Love and Craft. Eventually I'll be able to say it. And I had a really good time. I was so excited to get back into like a planner world. And oh, I was so excited and... Oh, it was just amazing. It was such a good day. I was only there for about an hour because there were so many people. I'm like, oh, I feel a bit weird, you know, being back with all these people again. And I went about 11 and I was starving. So I'm like, I'll be here for as long as I need to. And then I'll go and get some lunch. But, you know, an hour was long enough to get all of this. So I'm so excited. And I am really looking forward to using these. I already have plans for the washi. And I know where I'm going to use this kit. And these are just amazing. Get to go back and do some back planning for my lashes. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Oh, you're going to get to see me use these washies very shortly. And oh, I'm just so excited. You can find me over on Instagram at, at Amy's Planner. You should totally check me out there to see all of this in use. And I'll see you next time. Bye.